Hello, so Krather, today our topic is surge motor and what is a surge mo motor and what is how it has to be operate in their principle of a working and their operations as has been pointed in early that a wound shoot motor can be operated at the lower speed by a inserting the suitable resistance in a rotor circuit in this method a slip power power and the slip frequency dispute and happening a speed of a synchronous and the additional slips the power and push back into the supply instead uh, dispatching into the external resistance thus the in induction motor can be run as a super synchronous speed by feeding the power into the rotor for a proper functioning and the frequency of an emf injected by a slip power converter must be same is the frequency of induced emf in the rotor winding in case of a sub synchronous operation lower or high speed the additional rotor slip power of a retuning of a supply at a line frequency for the arrangement of a auxiliary devices containing the frequency converts Convert into the use a simple way such as our arrangement has been discussed in a in this motor. The wound wounding motor can frequently converted the scheme scheme were combined into the single frame by a HK surge in a such motor. Means that this motor is manufactured by a Search name of a scientist and then automatically the name will be going on motor surge motor it is a it is called according to the frequency and the ema function it will be called the called the super synchronous motor Suppose synchronous motor or a surge motor is basically an invented by a polyphase induction motor such a primary winding on the router and the secondary winding on a starter. The primary winding on a router is feed through the three slip rings and the bushes at the line frequency. Secondary winding on a stator has a slip frequency voltage induced it. How does a wound router motor works? A round router motor is a type of an induction motor where the motor winding are connected through the slip ring for to external resistance. Adjusting the resistance allows to control the speed doubling frequency characters of a router when the motor reaches the full speed the router pulls and switch it to the short circuit how does you test the wounding wound rotor motor the test the router of a ground connected one arm leads to be shaft and connected to the other leads to each one of a slip ring the ohm meter shows the continuously between the router winding and the ground like the starter winding the router is a difficult to, to test for a short winding in the electrical field there is a different type of a motors and the different type of electrical devices are utilized is a purpose of a working such so these devices are the motor, transformer and the, the cookers according to the utilization and the need of a people these motor will be utilized thanks for watching please subscribe my channel to get the more videos like this
and build up your technical knowledge in electrical. Thanks.